Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Savannah if you are new here. So today I'm going to be showing you guys some fashion hacks on how to dress up a basic white t-shirt or white long sleeve with a pair of jeans and just kind of things you can add. So I'm going to be showing you guys all the things that I use and kind of just tips on how to turn a basic outfit into a cute and fashionable outfit. Also, make sure to like and subscribe to my channel and follow me on Instagram. Link is always in the description. And let's get started. Okay, so here is the long sleeve white plain t-shirt with a pair of jeans. You can wear light jeans, dark jeans, whatever. They could be rips or non-rips. These are just non-rips because I like these ones the best. But it doesn't really matter what kind of jeans you wear. And then this shirt just has like a little pocket on the side. So one tip is to kind of roll up your sleeves and show off whatever jewelry you have on because jewelry can kind of make or break an outfit. So rolling up the sleeves gives like a nice little look if you're wearing long sleeves or even short sleeves. You can roll those up right here. And then I have a bunch of bracelets on. So this kind of gives nice little touch and then my necklaces as well. I have layered this little ball necklace and then this necklace has like a rose on it. But yes, so this kind of dress ups the outfit and gives like an extra touch and then also rings and whatever else you want to wear as jewelry. You could wear like a longer necklace and kind of give more like a dramatic look. But yeah, jewelry is a great tip and also rolling the sleeves to kind of give the t-shirt a cuter look. work my way from like the top of my body to the bottom with the details and stuff so I just went over like jewelry and all that and now I'm gonna talk about hair so hair can also spruce up your outfit my hair is just natural right now I didn't really do anything to it but you can either curl it or straighten it or you can put it up so I'm gonna show just one hairstyle that I like to do when I'm wearing like a basic outfit. Okay, so I just take half of my hair and kind of, I like to keep half of the part and kind of brush it into the ponytail, make it kind of messy, it doesn't have to be perfect. And then I just do either leave it like a ponytail like that and put a hair tie in and kind of like bring down pieces. Or right now I'm just gonna show you like a little top knot bun that you can do that's super cute and adds like an extra messy kind of look to it. So just like that, my hair is kind of just like all over the place. I'm gonna pull some pieces down right here and then I have my little top knot bun. So as you can see, the bun, hair, really you can do whatever. You can put it all in like a messy bun and pull pieces down. You could do a ponytail, whatever, but this is a great way to add like some touch to your outfit and make it not so plain and boring. So rather than having your hair just naturally down and didn't do anything to it, this is super easy, quick. Yeah. Okay, next fashion hack is just to throw on like a little jacket like this. This one just looks like this. It's kind of like a crop jacket. You can either tuck your shirt into your pants like so if you wanted or you could leave it longer whichever way you prefer but this just adds like a nice little touch and perfect for fall time as well but yeah this is one of my favorite jackets you can really wear any jacket you could wear like a longer trench coat or a shorter jacket a jean jacket whatever you prefer you could also like bring it down like that and have that look Okay, and now moving on to the shirt itself. There's many things that you can do. The main thing that I usually like to do is I just take a big, so if you have like a longer t-shirt, you just take the front of it, like a clear, or this is a nude little hair tie, tie it up into like a ponytail type look. So you have this hanging like that, and then you're just gonna tuck this in to your pants and then pull to make it a little looser and this gives that little tucked 
touch to the t-shirt. Using a hair tie is a lot better than not using a hair tie when you're tucking your shirt because it kind of helps it to stay in place and so it won't be moving around a lot and falling out of your pants. So yeah, just looks like that. If you wanted to, I don't always do this, but if you prefer, you can take it in the back and do the same thing to the back. So make a little like hair tie type thing, ponytail type thing, and then tuck that in and pull that out like so. So that is what it looks like in the back and in the front is just like a tighter look all around. Okay, another thing that you guys can add is just a little belt like this. I just picked this one up because I thought it would be cute with the outfit, just little gold detailing to it. And you would put that around the loops of your pants, obviously. And then it just looks like that. And you can either do the hair tie thing again. I'll show you guys. And tuck that into the shirt so you have the belt action going on. You can really wear any belt you prefer. I feel like anything would go with basic jeans and a white shirt. Okay, now next tip is just adding a little cute bag like this. This one just looks like that. Simple, cute. You can wear it like this just on the side or like a cross body. And then I also have this one. If you wanted to add like a pop of color, just the same, looks like this. It's just like a light purple e color. And then you can also wear it as like a crossbody. Looks cute either way, but yeah, this is just a great little touch to add a bag to a basic outfit. Okay, and now the next detailing I'm gonna talk about is your pants so for i'm gonna try to do this best i can okay now rolling your pants up like this so it gives that nice little roll rather than just having it playing down is also a great touch i just rolled it little rolls twice like this and voila super easy makes the outfit not so basic by rolling them. And another way, if you didn't like this look of the roll, but your, say your jeans are too long, you could just pinch it right here, fold it under, and then there you go. That gives it a shorter look to it if you are not a fan of the rolled look, so it's not so like bunched up, like this is a little bunched up. Or if I had longer jeans on, it would be a lot more bunched up, but you get the gist of it. Okay, and now my last fashion hack is just these shoes. So I have two pairs of shoes that I wanna show you, two very different styles. So these just like sneaker type shoes and they're actually like a light purple. I don't know if you guys can tell and they're suede. So this is very cute for like on the go day activities. And then this for more of a nighttime going out look, just Gucci heels, it has a chunkier heel so it's easy to walk. And then also a pop of color which adds a nice little look to the outfit. So yes, two very different looks, but kind of just wanted to show you guys that you could wear as like a casual daytime outfit by just adding the sneakers or you could wear it for nighttime by adding the heels all right guys so that's gonna wrap up today's video i hope you guys enjoyed and i hope you guys got some tips on my fashion hacks for basic white shirt and jeans make sure to like if you enjoyed and let me know if you want to see more videos like this because i have a ton of hacks for many different outfits so yeah i'll see you guys in my next video